Spring 10 brings the GA of the code scheduler. To demonstrate the code scheduler, I'll create a very basic Apex class. I'll just create a stub class that implements the schedulable interface. After I save this, I can go into my list of classes and I'll need to click the button that allows me to schedule Apex. This brings me into the code scheduler where you define your job with a name and then by selecting from the list of classes that have implemented the schedulable interface I'll select the one that I just created and then I'll determine the frequency. In this case I'll choose a weekly job to be run on Sundays with a preferred start time of 3 in the morning. The exact start time depends on the job queue activity. After I've created my schedule to see what's happened, I can click down to my monitoring and look at scheduled jobs. I see that a job has already been submitted and scheduled for me in the next scheduled runtime. So that's a very quick summary of the code scheduler in Spring 10.